Some Russians thought it was the end of the world. More than a thousand people hurt after a meteor exploded above the ground. The meteorites have fallen here in Connecticut too. News News8's Tina Detel in the New London newsroom at the day. She spoke to one woman who had a very close call. Only twice have meteorites struck the same U.S. town or city. It happened in Honolulu and Wethersfield. Long before dashboard cams and cell phones captured this spectacular sight over Russia, something out of this world happened right in Wethersfield. Two meteorites struck homes, one on Middletown Avenue in 1971 and another at this Church Street house 11 years later. We were watching MASH on TV. We heard this tremendous crash in the front of the house and we thought a truck had barreled into the house. So we ran into the living room and we looked up and we saw the night sky. Wanda Donahue's husband shared that celestial experience with News 8 back in 1982. The meteorite is now at Yale's Peabody Museum, along with another one which landed in Weston in 1807. I was astounded. That's the best word. <laughs> An historic event worthy of a place at the Weathersfield Historical Society. Donahue's roof and ceiling show the tremendous force with which the space rock fell. I walked through the doorway ju just about 10 minutes before where it crashed. A close call, but she tries not to dwell on it. All this talk about meteorites comes as an asteroid is passing by Earth more than 17,000 miles away this afternoon. Of course, though, that is a safe distance from this house or any others. Donahue isn't concerned about another strike. I, I wouldn't mind another one, as long <laughs> as nobody got hurt. <laughs> And that's the key, as long as no one is hurt. Now, unfortunately, folks were hurt when that five-ton meteorite crashed into Russia. In the New London Newsroom at the Day, Tina Detell, News 8.